Do you want to know how to turn your GoPro into a vlogging machine? Well, check it out. Whoa. Wow. Wow. First, I'm going to show you some footage of the GoPro and what it looks like, the quality, and how it sounds with the microphone and all the accessories added. And then I'm going to show you how I actually built it. All right, let's take a look. Today we're going to test this in real world situations. It's a windy day. I got a bike to the circus. We're going to see how it goes with the wind and with the other audio that picks up. Let's go. Now, riding directly beside the highway. So you'll be able to tell what kind of noise is being picked up from the microphone from my voice versus the surrounding noise. Also, we get a real good opportunity to listen to see if there's any wind pickup from the wind, from the trees that are around us, and from me bicycling. Alright, here's the collection of all the items that I needed to build the GoPro vlogging machine. Alright, now let's put this beast together. Alright, first we're going to take the case, and when you get the case you want to make sure that you get the one with the sliding back door. Then you put the GoPro in, close the door, and tighten the screw on the right side just to make sure that your GoPro is secure. We're going to take one of our quarter inch adapters, we're going to hook it to a connector, and we're going to put two washers on there so we can screw that into the bottom nice and secure. We're going to take another quarter inch adapter, put that on the top. That's the one we're going to screw our cold shoe mount into, which is inevitably going to hold the microphone. Tighten those up, make sure it's nice and lined. Next we grab the mini ball head, and what we do is we put two little washers on the mini ball head when we screw that into, so that the quarter inch screw doesn't smash into the GoPro. Now it's time to connect the microphone. First we put the stand in, make sure that's screwed secured tightly the cold shoe. Then we add the microphone. The microphone has a nice little groove so you know right where to put it when you hook it into the base. Now the last thing, all we have to do is add the dead cat to the microphone. Alright, the only way to connect any kind of external microphone to the GoPro is to buy the GoPro adapter. It's a little bit more pricey, but it's the only way to go. Alright, once we've got the USB-C plugged into the GoPro, we're going to take the cell phone mount, screw that onto the mini ball head. Make sure it's tight, but you don't have to worry about where it's facing right now because you can always change that later when you adjust the ball head. Grab your quick release plate from your big ball head, and you're going to fasten that to the bottom of the connector on the bottom of the GoPro. Depending on the ball head that you get, you may end up with a 3 8 inch screw to screw into the bottom of your connector. Now the connectors that I'm going to put in the description below will have an adapter. When you're lining your quick release plate, you want to make sure that when it's connected to the ball head, that the arm is facing away from where the cell phone is going to be. If you line it the wrong way, you won't be able to put your cell phone into the cell phone holder. The last part of the build is just screwing the tripod into the base of the ball head. I like to use the Joby SLR Gorilla Pod. It's flexible and allows me to use the tripod in many different areas. Not only just to clamp onto things, but it stands up pretty well too. And for the weight of this setup, it's very stable and sturdy. Alright, the last part's pretty simple. We're just going to take the cable and connect the microphone to the GoPro microphone adapter. Alright, let's get some video. We're going to add our smartphone to the cell phone holder so that we can use it as a monitor when we Wi-Fi from the GoPro when we're using it in our selfie mode. This is really important because we want to be able to frame our subjects. Alright, let's fire it up. Now we got our monitor. Everything looks good. Alright, you did it. So there you have it. The GoPro 5 Hero Vlogging Machine. Hey guys, 
If you like this video and you want to see some more cool stuff around the circus and in Japan, check out my channel below. Definitely subscribe, like, or send me a comment about what you want to see and I'll try and make a video for you. Do it!